because I'm a brown person, you're trusting me. What do you like, mean? Like, you're like, she must know some weird witch doctor. Yeah, well, I, it's because you suggested it. I was like, I'm feeling sick, and you're like, oh, you should have some golden milk. I'm a big fan of homeopathy, mm -hmm. and so I was like, how can I Did cure you say my homeopathy? Homeopathy? Home, 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 home <laughs> That's home closer for sure. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I think it's homeopathy. <laughs> homeopathy. Yeah. <laughs> this is not going to be the way it's meant to be because it's not warm, so they're just like large chunks of turmeric in it. Oh my god. Um, but guzzle guzzle down I, the hatch. I really do feel like I'm like someone's dad or something and their daughter is <laughs> like, see daddy, it'll help. Alright, let's... Well, <laughs> this is not... Here, you, it's... <laughs> Take over the camera. Okay. Hold it. Hold it landscape style. There you okay. go. Let's see. I am starting to feel better, although I think it might also just be... You're just the, dehydrated. I am dehydrated. I also think it might be just the contact eye off of you. Mmm. <laughs> <laughs> Do I have turmeric crumbs in my mustache? Probably. Okay. What time is it now? It's 10.55, so we can head over to Iguana. Woo! Hello, and welcome to another episode of Drift. Our guest this week is comedian Christine Madrano. Christine took us to the Iguana Vintage Shop in North Hollywood, California. As far as the thrifty thing goes, so this place is actually technically a vintage store based on what I researched. Oh, is but there, I'm, I'm not, the, see, that's, Okay, okay, hold on, yeah. hold on. There's no rule about that as far as I'm concerned. The I'm mostly interested in stuff that's secondhand. And the whole vintage thing is basically like, yeah, they usually crawl through thrift stores to, to, get it. to find the gems and then they mark it up to like, you know, pay for the time they spend. Oh, cool. Looking for, like uh, curating it. Exactly. Um, and I do think that there's a sense in which it's, you know, thrift shopping is somewhat about saving money. It's also just about like buying things that were not fre freshly made, you know what I mean? Reusing yeah. goods in the consumer economy. And it's okay if there's different levels of like... A hierarchy? Yeah, exactly. If, if yeah, there's absolutely. more lux luxury type stuff. Is that, can I put there? I think so, but... I don't want to. I'm no expert. Yeah, just look for I'll the... Around. Look for the parking spot that's right for you. Oh, thank you. Right, here we go. <laughs> Bada boom. That truck is huge behind this. Yeah. It's like the size... That's, that's what my dating life looks like, this car next to that truck. What do you mean? Oh, because you're dating these big guys? Yeah. <laughs> Usually. If this was a few years ago, I would absolutely be buying a tiny blazer. But because I've grown as a person, I don't have to be that person. Who wears a blazer? Who wears a blazer? <laughs> if you wore that, I would kind of, I would think it was cool. Hi, my name's Matilda. This is kind of great. This is just, this, speaking of bougie, this is just kind of like... <laughs> <laughs> like, that's how this person laughs. And I want to be that person. If I saw that, though, I'd take a picture to be like, sees Westworld once. <laughs> that's what I would look. Oh, shoot. <laughs> how did I just ruin it? Did I shatter? Put in the back, yeah. Like, this looks like it could be cute. I just hate this detail. Oh, that little, like, camo pocket? Do you think I should try it on? No, I never, it never works out. I think that if it's interesting, you should give it a shot, and if it doesn't All right, work, okay, then, God. You know what? Maybe I'll do overalls, too, actually. Yeah, let's do overalls. Let's do matching. Overalls with a shirt under and, like, R Robbie Crockett, what's his name? Something Crockett? Davy Crockett? Davy Crockett hats. Oh, that's fun. I, I actually do really like this outfit. I like my outfit, too. I'm just yeah. gonna get a look at the camera, like... We look good. We look I good know. in these outfits. I love this. I want to wear this out not as a costume, but just like to the store to hang out with my friend. How much? Know. This is sixty dollars. This is a lot of money for it a is. For, for a novelty a... item. Yes, that was the way I was gonna put it. You're basically buying a Halloween costume. Yeah, I know. But like, hmm. <laughs> like I would just sit around my apartment and get high in this. Are you putting a sailor cap on with that? I feel like you're mixing genres. I was wearing a Kangol hat, it was too big. I think so too, but I feel like it works. Like if I was just watch. Can we do? <laughs> the hat works, but that bag. Okay, so you can do the bag though. It's like you can add one. I can be like a girl, just kind of like. Are you Jonathan? Oh, I'm your, you're my Uber. Honestly, if I lived in New York and was 
lived in a loft and had was a millionaire, I'd wear this. So this is the Three Stooges cup that uh, Miles gave me to commemorate my time on the show Thrift, be in Iguana thrift store. Um, and I hope I have had as much fun today as they are having golf, playing golf, not having golf. <laughs>